Oh my god. Is that a spider? Uh, I hate spiders. Go away. Oh, baby, a triple. What's going on, you guys? Oh, wait, I zoomed into the wrong place. Anyways, what's going on you guys? My name is Cole and welcome back to another video. So what's going on in Clash Army today? We're gonna be showing you guys some epic defenses. Are you ready for this witches? Are you excited? Fuck yeah, I'm so excited Cole. I'm so freaking excited. Do you hear that you guys? The witches are excited So hopefully you guys are just as pumped as them So I'm gonna go ahead and go over some pretty awesome defenses from the last war and let's get right into this bitch So just to start things off as you can see we went up against another one of these I modding clans as you can see They three starred every single base for the most part um, Because they're a bunch of freaking cheaters But yeah, anyways, let's go ahead and check out the defense that uh, we actually did defend against so first off We're gonna go ahead and check out Wonginator's attack right here and this was a 42% uh, I'm kind of curious what the attack was and I'm guessing it is pro oh wow so he's using dragons and uh, looks like they're pretty low level um, he's obviously a town all nine so this is a town all nine versus a town all ten oh my god you guys this is gonna be super intense he's dropping down little dragons on the outside oh my god there's so many freaking dragons right there oh my god and he got some balloons he thinks this is his birthday huh you think it's your birthday xy 5 dcz god damn I wish you could just have a normal name why are you so crazy man this base is looking cute i mean look at all these freaking storages that's that's looking pretty nasty dude make it nasty mm, make that base nasty oh here comes the cutie little uh, flying skeletons dragons are like yep not gonna not gonna have to waste my time with you uh he's gonna go ahead and make his way up towards the center going up from the bottom this guy's obviously gay because he likes to go up from the bottom ha yay Oh, but here comes the clan castle. He has a few of these minions. Uh, we actually didn't fill clan castles this war, so I'm surprised he had any. Uh, he's really close to the town hall, but these multi-target infernos are just going to absolutely tear his dragons apart. This dragon's like, I quit. I'm going to the side. I can't handle it. There's too much pressure. Looks like he made a big pair of tits with those rage spells. That looks super hot. Man, I'm going to have to try and not get a boner this video. Um, but yeah, one minute left, and all he has is some archers, his archer queen, and some minions. So he's probably going to do some dropping on the outside, so let's go ahead and speed this up. See what he does here. I will go ahead and put it back to normal speed as soon as he brings out his archer queen. Uh, any day now. Come on, dude. You got this. Just put her up the middle. You got it. And, uh, is he going to do anything? Okay, here he goes. Full attack! And the queen is like, okay, shit, why did I, why did I even sign up for this job? He didn't even activate her ability. What the hell was that? Or did he? Or did he? That is a good question. Hmm. But yeah, you guys, let's go ahead and move on to the next attack. Okay, and now we have the next attack. And this one is actually uh, T-Bot. He is actually doing a full attack against an Asian guy. This is going to be interesting. So he drops down his purple golems, uh, backs it up by those max little wizards. God, I want them so bad. Um... Yeah, I'm probably going to go ahead and get to Town Hall 10 pretty soon, you guys. I don't know if you watch my videos, but yeah, once I hit 50,000 subs, I will be doing Town Hall 10 gemming video, and it's going to be super awesome, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. And wow, this guy has a lava hound in his clan castle. It's actually pretty funny because we didn't really attack at all in this war because we already knew they were going to cheat from the beginning. Um, so they pretty much just wasted a bunch of Dark Elixir on those lava hounds, so suck it, you guys. Suck it, you freaking cheating Chinese guys, or I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and look at their clan location later. Um, but yeah, the attack is going uh, not so good. Uh, as you can see, he didn't even uh, bring a jump spell. What the hell, T-Bot? Really? Why didn't you bring a jump spell, you noob? Um, but yeah, the queen is being distracted by these little lava pups. He's going to go ahead and activate her special ability. Try and take out a few of those guys. Uh, drops down a freeze spell again. He still has a rage spell, a lightning, and a few archers on the outside. Uh, going to go ahead and drop that there. Very smart and, strate and strategic. I almost said strategic. That, uh, that didn't make sense. And uh, there we go, 45%, so pretty good uh, defend. We'll just call this guy Jerry. Uh, so Jerry, great defense, 45%. I'm sorry, T-Bot, you just couldn't pull off the raid. And yeah, you guys, so now let's go ahead and get on to the last raid of the episode. Okay, you guys, we're about to cut the glass on this one. Or is he? That is the real question. So it looks like he's going to be using Lava Lunion, I believe it's called. Uh, that is the one with the Lava Hounds and the Balloons. So he did something pretty smart there. Uh, dropped down some early Balloons to get that Clan Castle out of there. Now he's going to go ahead and bring them up to the top. He's like, come over here, guys. I got free candy. And the Wizards are like, yeah, free candy? Are you kidding me? I love free candy. Mmm. And uh, yeah, the Archer Queen's like, ha, psych. There ain't no free candy for you, suckas. And now he's going to begin his attack. Uh, uh, I'm guessing 
Wait, what the hell is he doing? What is he doing? Yeah, okay, never mind. I see what he's doing now. So he's probably going to drop down a couple of raid spells uh, in boob formation. So there he goes, moving up onto the town hall. Is he going to go far? It uh, looks like they took out that first air defense. These hogs are, no, they're not hogs. They're lava hounds. Flying hogs. That'd be freaking hilarious, wouldn't it? Oh, man. I'm going to quit clash the day that hogs fly. Just kidding. Actually, I don't know. Supercell, please don't make Hog Riders fly. But yeah, he made his way into the center. Uh, didn't get very far with that. The other king is like, hell no. You get out of my base. I'm going to beat the crap out of you golems. You sons of bitches. French motherfuckers. Oh, cut back here. And yeah, the queen's like, hell no. So, oh my god, that was a... That was a really fast death. I mean, she double shot at him, activated the special ability, 39%, and uh, he's got five archers left. So what are you going to do, SF, nevermore? I guess you're nevermore going to attack people. <laughs> God, that was such a fucking bad joke. That was a terrible joke. Oh, man, I should just stop making jokes. My jokes aren't even funny in the first place. But, yeah, you guys, um, looks like he's going to end this one. I'm going to actually predict, I'm going to say 44%. What do you guys think? Come on, 44%, 42, 44, oh shit, I lied to you guys, no, no, stop it, Archer, it has to be 44%, it can't be anymore, please, please stop, just stop, no, oh no, oh, you son of a bitch, okay, 45%, huh? Whatever, at least you didn't get any stars, so ha ha ha, suck it, you loser. But yeah, you guys, that's going to wrap up this episode of Defensive Replays. I don't even know what to call it. I'll figure out the title and uh, stuff when I edit this. But yeah, with that being said, I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. So good night, Clash Army. Good day. Good whatever. But with that being said, love you. That shit's ridiculous.